Hi, this is Alex and I'm going to show you how to integrate your RS Form Pro and your constant contact list. By integrating these two, you will get a contact added to your list every time your form gets submitted. You can download the integration plugin from your website and install it by following the usual steps. If you don't know what these are, go to Extensions, Extension Manager, and in the Upload File tab, browse for your installation package and click Upload and Install. If the plugin was installed correctly, you should see this message. Keep in mind that the plugin needs to be published in order for this to work. So head to Extensions, Plugin Manager, and publish it. The integration will be available for each of your forms. However, as you can see, more information is required for it to work. Head to your RS Form Pro component and click Configuration. Here, you'll need to enter an API key and access token. Luckily, we've included a link to the page where you can get them. You will need to follow the exact steps provided in the Constant Contact Guide. You will also need a Constant Contact Developer account and Mashery to get the application and token. After signing in with the account, register your application to get the API key. Once you get the key, you will be able to generate the token. Copy and paste both the key and token in the RS Form Pro configuration area and save the changes. We have already prepared a form containing the default fields found in the constant contact subscription form. In the form's properties area, click on the constant contact integration tab. Set use constant contact integration to yes in order to enable the integration for this form. The action option lets you either subscribe or unsubscribe from the submitter to a list. If you map it with a select field containing subscribe and unsubscribe values, you let the user decide the action to be taken. The list ID field will be automatically populated with the lists available in your constant contact account. So choose the list where your contacts will be added. Also, all other default constant contact fields can be mapped with your form fields in order to record the necessary information. Save the form once you're done with the configuration and mappings. 
Now let's submit the form and see if it works as expected. Head to your Constant Contact account. A new contact was created based on the submitted information. Well, that was it. I hope you liked this tutorial. Until next time, at Really Simple Joomla.